We all love a kick-ass single-player experience, and for many, the multiplayer aspects of a video game can be an afterthought. Yet over the years, gaming online has improved dramatically. With all of us spending the majority of 2020 at home, online gaming has seen a serious boom. To the point, many aren't even bothering with single-player experiences. Let's face it, there is nothing more exhilarating than taking first place in a battle royale match, or going on a 15 kill kill streak. 2020 saw some excellent and goofy multiplayer experiences rise to the top. Without wasting any more time, let's get to the best multiplayer games of 2020 as voted by the COG Connected team. Streets of Rage 4 is easily the biggest surprise to make our multiplayer rankings, but several people on the COG Connected crew felt it needed a vote. The multiplayer experience has a little something for everybody. You've got arena battles, boss rush mode, options for 4 player free for all, and team battle fights. It's easy to dismiss Streets of Rage 4 as a simple arcade game, but it's a deep experience with plenty to offer. It isn't the best multiplayer game of the year, but certainly worthy of making our list, taking home the 7th spot. When we talk about Ghost of Tsushima, we don't often think about its multiplayer components. Its single player experience is fantastic, so when it was revealed that a free multiplayer expansion was on the way, that caught many of us by surprise. Ghost of Tsushima Legends was released on October 16th, 2020, where players either take on the two-player story missions, four-player wave-based missions, or difficult raids. Sure, it doesn't offer the same online experience as other online experiences, but the Horde-style gameplay should not be overlooked. It's incredibly fun and an absolute must-play if you own the base game. Destiny's community remains as strong as ever, and Destiny 2 Beyond Light only served to enhance an already rock-solid multiplayer experience. Released on November 10th, 2020 as the fifth expansion of Destiny 2, Beyond Light includes a glut of new content, including new missions, player versus environment locations, gear, weaponry, and a punishing new raid. Also, Beyond Light was the first expansion of Destiny 2 released on and fully optimized for the PlayStation 5 and Xbox Series X and S platforms. Bungie described this expansion as the beginning of a new era for the Destiny franchise, and for good reason. It's just that good. Valorant could easily be higher on the list. It's an excellent tactical shooter that has been compared to Valve's Counter-Strike Global Offensive. It's also been compared to Rainbow Six Siege and Overwatch. Valorant is immersive and intense, offering up multiple classes catering to various playstyles. On the first day of its beta launch, Valorant amassed the second most concurrent viewers for any game ever on Twitch. We scored the game an 85 out of 100, praising the badass characters, wonderful design, and brilliant training mode. For PC shooter fans looking for a hardcore strategic shooter, it doesn't get much better than Valorant. Fall Guys managed to make a couple of our Game of the Year 2020 list, as it was also one of the biggest and most pleasant surprises of the year. There is really nothing sophisticated about it. The game requires a certain amount of luck and a degree of skill. Yet there is no denying it's a hilarious, goofy, and thrilling game suitable for all ages. Anyone can pick up and play Fall Guys, and they would not regret it at all. Similar to Fall Guys, Among Us came out of nowhere in 2020. 
In some respects, we really shouldn't be including it in our game of the year list this year. I mean, nobody was playing it until right smack dab in the middle of a global pandemic. Okay, it's not like nobody was playing it before 2020, but you get the point. It didn't experience that massive influx of gamers until everyone started making Among Us memes on the internet. Its simplicity and social aspects make Among Us one of the best multiplayer experiences of the year. Selecting the winner was easy, as Warzone is the best battle royale map on the planet. Taking elements from Fortnite, PUBG, and Blackout, Warzone delivers a fantastic multiplayer experience that is not only addicting, but is a balanced and incredibly intense experience. Not to mention, it is absolutely thrilling when you take the top spot. It's so good, the new Call of Duty game, Cold War, isn't even ditching Warzone and has decided to keep supporting the mode. The Battle Pass system keeps players coming back for more, and that intense online shooter experience is something players won't be turning their back from anytime soon. But what was your favorite multiplayer game of the year? Tell us in the comments below, and make sure to like the video, subscribe to the channel, and hit that notification bell. It really helps us create the very best content for you.